Here, I will show you how to assemble the 10.1 inch HDMI LCD H, and how to use it. First part, show you how to assemble the case of the 10.1 inch HDMI LCD H. There are three screw packs. The left one is used to mount the control board to acrylic. The middle packs is for assembly the LCD with the acrylic board. And the last is used for mounting your development board like Raspberry Pi. Open the buckle, and insert the flexible flat cable to the RGB interface of control board. Please keep the metal side down. Close the buckle. Make sure the flexible flat cable was plugged tightly. Mounting the control board to the acrylic. Firstly, insert the screws to the holding hole of control board. Then insert the plastic gasket. Combine the acrylic board, keeping the interface of control board facing out. Finally turning the nut tightly. There are two interfaces on the LCD, one is RGB and another is LVDS. LVDS is a reserved interface, which cannot be used on this LCD virtually. Insert the other side of flexible flat cable to the RGB interface of LCD as some as we done before. Remove the nuts which are on four corner of LCD. Replacing them with the pillars. And put the acrylic board during the nuts tightly. In this part, shows you how to use the 10.1 inch HDMI LCD H. Plugging the HDMI cable to HDMI interface of control board, the connect the other side of the cable to the PC or development BOAD, and insert the external power supply. If you need to use the touch function, you have to connect the touch interface to your PC with USB cable. Power on, then you can see that the LCD is displaying blue and words that no signals, in this case, you need to switch the input mode to HDMI. Press source key to switch the mode. 
Then, using the right key and left key to choose the exact HDMI, finally, press menu key to confirm the schwa's. Waiting for a moment, and you can see that the LCD enter the desktop. If the LCD is connected to PC, we needn't to set the resolution, and if it is worked with development board, we need to set the resotion of LCD for displaying properly. You can also press the menu button to open the menu for function configuration. Some of the functions are just reserved for hardware, cannot be set in fact. That's all, thank you for watching.